Hey guys, no beer. Today we're going to be doing part 4 in my series, My Desktop Environments. Today we're going over Overmox. Yes, I know technically as a window manager, but how I'm using I'm using as a uh, desktop environment. Things I'd like to add before we get started. Yes, I went back to Integros. My friend was talking about it, I thought I'd give it a try. I know you're going to give me heck about it, but hey guys, I thought I'd give it a second chance. I like to give any dish a second chance. And I will be eventually going into the distro wise, but for now I just want to do my desktop environments and kind of go from there. But let's go ahead and begin. Um, by default, in Integros Openbox, you'll have a bar on the top, which will be the temp bar on top, and you'll have plank on the bottom. I switched around, I put plank on top and put the bar, uh, temp bar on the bottom. The temp bar will actually not look like this, I actually did customize this to my liking. And the uh, plank, it'll look like this just as uh, on the bottom. I put on the top because I just like on the top. Also, I like their new mix theming off the start. Has wonderful theming without even uh, doing anything. <clears throat> Alright, let's begin. To do pretty much anything in Openbox, you want to right click and you're going to get some settings like application places recent files, preferences, and exit. Some of the applications, pretty much anything in accessories came by default. I don't think there's anything in accessories I added. Yeah, there's nothing in accessories I added. Education, yeah, I added the LibreOffice, which I'll go ahead and show you. I have all LibreOffice, Document Viewer, and Dictionary. Games, I did put Steam on here. I had to go in there and activate the multi-lib, but I figured that out, and yeah, I'm happy. Um, Office Internet, I do have Firefox for my daily driver browser, Google for my Netflix, Mumble just for voice server, Qubit Turn is a wonderful torrenting pl program. I always use it because it always gives me the best speeds. Yes, there's Deluge. I wasn't a big Deluge fan. That's probably my second. I will probably add it again just to kind of test it and see performance on here. Because I wasn't getting the best performance on Qubit, but I'm a, I'm a kind of benchmark them and see which one the best is for me. Kind of uh, look and appeal. The look and appeal of Qubit kind of looks like uh, uTorrent on uh, Windows. That's kind of why I like Q, uh, Qubit Torrent. But that's for a different day, a different video. Let's move on. And TeamSpeak, I love TeamSpeak, and I'm glad I can get on. Uh, I could get on here. Other ISWM is another window manager. I will go into that maybe in a later video, maybe in a later uh, part of the series. But for now, we'll leave that alone. Programming, yeah, I don't really mess with any of this. It's just game default. Sound, I add Spotify, and here's the simple screen recorder I'm using to record to you now. System tools, I have add and remove software, which the only reason I have this is I actually Octopi. And the only reason I have it is for the notifier. And yeah, the, here's the tint two, which you can actually find it in preferences. Here's the config. You edit the tint wizard to kind of get a GUI or at the RC and actually do it through the RC file. Wallpaper. I got a nice wallpaper off the internet, and this is con uh, Conky. I'm probably gonna get Conky Manager and change this. But for now, this is going to stay the same. I That will pretty much about wrap it up, guys. Uh, one thing I'd like to mention, I do still have the suggestion board. I will leave a link still in this uh, video. My friend, Mim, I have to thank for kind of giving me the courage to kind of give this to show a second chance. Because I'm I'm liking this. I'm liking this open box with uh, Ntera Gross. Um... But yeah, guys, it's about wraps it up. Um, oh, one thing I forgot to mention: the file manager is a uh, PC Man FM, which is very simple and co uh, not complex. Doesn't have all the features. But when you're dealing with something like Openbox, you don't want something with a lot of features. You just want something to move smoothly on Openbox. So yeah, I, I love it. It's it's nice for really just something simplistic so yeah that will wrap up this video guys today this is Noble 
signing out.